Alright, hey guys, so today I wanted to show you how you can find your iPhone or iPod Touch firmware on your computer or on your Mac. Like, there's videos how to do it on your PC, I haven't really found one yet how to find it on a Mac unless I just didn't search very good, but whatever. Um, anyway, so, like, let's say you plug in your iPhone and it says to update, which you have your jailbreak in it, and you don't want to, you know, totally update it, and you can download it of course, but then whenever you jailbreak it, you have to have the f actual file, which you can download online, of course, but, um, I mean, if you've already downloaded it through iTunes, then I suggest just going ahead and find it on your Mac. And how you do that is, you go to your user folder, which right there, mine is, then you go to library, and then you scroll down until you find iTunes, and you click on iTunes folder, and then right here is going to be all your iTunes stuff, or your, yeah, your iTunes stuff, and then right there it is, iPhone software updates, and I downloaded the, uh, I just recently downloaded the 3.3, 3.1.3, um, file, which I have the iPhone 3GS, so I can't jailbreak it right now, but that's the file right there, there it is, because, like, whenever you use the Ponage tool, you have to have this file right here on hand, um, because it's not going to be able to find it, I mean, unless you put it on your desktop, then you'll be able to find it, but that's, that's how you do it. Okay, guys, thanks for watching, this was a really short video, I hope you enjoyed it, I hope it helps you out. Like, uh, you know, if you've already downloaded it through iTunes, why go and take the extra step or the extra time to download another file off the internet? Okay, hope, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Bye.